Hello beautiful people, thank you so very much for stopping by on my YouTube channel Ivan Atero. Weekly laughter reading for Zodiac sign, Sagittarius, February 22nd until 28th. Come on, join me and have some fun. What a beautiful romantic tune, guys. I hope you are in a good mood. And Sages, let me start with the very first message for you. What you need to know, what you need to be focused on. Okay. New beginnings. Nice. Is this is something that you wanted for yourself? New beginning. New adventure, new people, new horizons, new possibilities, no restriction, no restriction. So big burden is falling off from your chest and you are just about to start something new. So let's see together guys what this might be. Give me a sec. I need another light as well. So let me reshuffle my deck and let me see guys what will happen with this new adventure. Could be a new person entering into your life. Could be a little bit younger than you are. And you have enough of restrictions. You want to simplify your life and you will. And you are simply ready for something new. Some of you will have finally opportunity to travel. You can see if you want to see the world or if you want to start something completely new, including new job. Queen of Wands or King of Wands in a general prediction. My, my, this is good. This is very powerful. So this could be you since this tarot card represents and describes Aries, Leo and Sagittarius zodiac sign. Or could be another Sag, could be Aries, could be Leo. This is a very powerful person and could be love related, could be friendship related. Generally speaking, Queen of Wands is very attractive person so you will discover how you can achieve to be more attractive. You will do something with your look. So you are strong, cheerful, in a good mood, starting this week as self-confident. There is nothing you can't conquer. You can conquer whatever you want. I think this is, guys, you and story about you. You look very attractive. And you can attract someone completely new. Major card of full, completely new start. Okay, so you are in the mood of a warrior. Or maybe you can start new love relationship with Eris, Leo or Sage. Okay, whatever you want, you can achieve in this week. So many new pets will be open for you. Choose one and be sure this is it. And even if you want to change your mind, you can do that as well. A lot of new opportunities. Uh, Eight of Cups. Okay, Eight of Cups is such a beautiful tarot card, which talks about friends and friendship in general. So guys, I think this uh, lockdown I think soon just might end, I hope, because I can see you visiting some clubs, uh, restaurants and some coffee shop. You can see this is you having a real good time. This is you being loose and enjoying in conversation with a good friends, good partner good people. I can see smile on your face. This tarot card talks about pleasure, hedonism, good food, 
a good atmosphere going out and mingling with a real good friends. So, cheers! I hope this is you and your partner starting maybe a new phase of your relationship. If you're single, pay attention. Aries Leo Sag, could be Scorpio, very seductive person, always in a good mood, person which, who can find always good solution for you, for them, or for anything. So guys, you need to loosen up, relax a bit. Everything will be taken care of. No drama, no fears, or anything of that kind. Wow, two of cups, Sages. You are the only zodiac sign in this week having two of cups in your weekly tarot reading. So now you know. If you're attached, stay with your partner. No drama, no special treatment, no special wishes. Uh, nurture what you have because it looks so good. This is unconditional love, mutual feelings, love and mutual respect. But if you are still single, then go out, loosen up, relax, forget about worries. And Eris Sage or Scorpio could surprise you with something. I can see some chemistry between you and this person, even if you're still single. I can see some chemistry. I can see some, you know, the look, you know, when someone is watching you and you can feel there is more to it than just friendship, you know, look. There is more to it. So there's like a fluid ongoing uh, between you and this person. And you know why they are watching you constantly. They like you. But guys, with the Two of Cups, this is something much more. This is your current partner or someone new. This is not your ex. But I will pull more tarot cards. So, Sages, congratulations. You have Two of Cups. Perfect love partner. Current. Keep them. Or someone completely new. You can start new love relationship with a joke. You can start a relationship with a person for whom you ever never thought, oh my, this could be my soulmate. So uh, this is you giving a chance, more like, you know, friendship tie. And then you can expect a miracle, miracle of love. So everything will start like a joke, you know what I mean, you know, in a very relaxed type of way. But this person could surprise you. Uh, nine of Swords, okay. Nine of Swords is a difficult set of cards, which talks about fears, doubts, mental pain, anxiety, headache, depression, um, anguish, or guys, you know, whatever. Maybe you think too much. Maybe you are afraid too much. This is why you have new beginnings and major kind of the full. So guys, try to be relaxed, carefree, and God will take care for everything else. So Nine of Swords is showing you are afraid of something. Like you are losing control of your life, losing control of your partner. You don't need that. You can keep your partner by loving them. And that's it. This is all you need to do. And even guys, you know, for current, not for current, but for possible new uh, future, don't think so much. Go with the flow and ride this wave because it's so good. So stop doing, you know, weird combination in your head. Just go with the flow. Guys, remember, I can see you, them, and this 
uh, this miracle which is connecting the two of you is love. Two of Cups is miracle of love. So remember new beginning. Magnetic attraction. Sages, what more you need to know? Magnetic attraction between the two of you. So you are watching one another. You can read the body language and still you can be a little bit you know, confused, thinking, no, they are not uh, watching me, they are watching someone else. No, 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 no. They are staring at you, smiling at you. And there you have it. Best is yet to come. Of course, best is yet to come, guys, when you have two of cups. And this is basically your face. This one. So, Sagis, finger crossed. In this week, a lot of things could happen between you and I think your friend. I think your friend. And you will love it. So, remember, best is yet to come. Unconditional love. Comment, like, share, subscribe on my channel. Thank you. God bless you all.